going to be on air. On air. Okay. Ooh, pressure. kinds of pressure going on this weekend. Ooh. We can we'll, we'll talk about NASCAR in a minute. Under pressure. But All I, over the place. I, I'm currently Oh you're currently under pressure. I'm currently glancing over there at the Cubs and the Cardinals. Welcome back to No Ends No Tomatoes. Oh, Make sure you rude. guys follow us on um, Facebook, Twitter, Twitter. YouTube. <laughs> YouTube. Hey especially Twitter. We're trying to be really active on that one. So we're um, at um, at no onion underscore tomato. Now back to now back to your Cubs and Car the, your Cardinals going against the Cubs. Or there's another base hit by the stupid Cubs. Anyway, the Cardinals. If we don't win today, we're done. So there's two games left in the season. The pressure is on. The Do your team's not out. Of the Dodgers. Okay, so right now we're fighting. It's our teams. Um, her Cardinals, my Dodgers, are fighting for the right. To probably get their ears boxed by the by the oh, Milwaukee Bre Brewers, oh, the Brewers in the wild card. Well. I mean, well, the, if if the Dod if the Dodgers win a game and Colorado loses the game, they ended up tied. There would be a playoff on Monday in Dodger Stadium to, to decide see. the NL West winner and then and who the goes three to the wild, wild card. and who goes to the wild card. But hey, you guys are you guys are there one one. Um, ooh, the Cubs have men on first and second uh, with no outs at the top of the fourth. Let's move on. <laughs> well, the other pressure thing going on is the Ryder Cup. We were up at, in the middle of the night, 3 o'clock in the morning, watching stupid golf over in Paris. Oh, I love to go to Paris. I mean, I don't, you're talking about pressure. Yeah, I'll tell you one thing. The United States players, you guys, you guys don't react good to this Ryder Cup pressure. They're down 10-6. You want to talk about um, ear boxing? There's ear boxing going all over the place. Tiger is 0 for 4 in, in, in group play, in, in team play, and four, four ball, an alternate shot. People um, aren't showing up. They are down. Uh, the, the United States is down 10-6. Um, uh, Europe needs 14, 14 and a half points. You need 14 and a half points to win the Ryder Cup. So or, so we need 14 and a half to retain it. Uh we that means we have to win. Ooh, there's 12 matches tomorrow. Let me do my quick math. We have to win at least probably. Well, let's say nine nine of those 12. Pressure raining down on me. Was that pretty good? Did I? Did you think it was? No. You need to fly to Paris and sing it to those yahoos, man. All right. Well, let's go to Charlotte then. Oh my goodness, we're going to Charlotte. Hey, look, we're going to Charlotte. Oh my God, we're going back to the home of NASCAR for the Charlotte 400. They only made it, it's 400, right? Oh, but guess what? Geez. They said, you know what? We're tired of this nonsense. We're going to put a road course into the chase. And not any old road course. Like, we're not going to put Watkins Glen in there that everybody knows. We're not going to put Sonoma in there, which everybody knows, or even like a Road America in Canada. Or even Mexico, Mexico, Monterey, they have a road course. That's right. You know, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna make our own. We're gonna make our own at the home of NASCAR. We're gonna, and you know what? We're gonna, and we're gonna make it 17 turns. 17 turns. We're There's gonna, usually only four. We're gonna use three quarters of the actual um, track. Yes. And then we're gonna go in the infield. And, and make you have eight turns on the infield. Eight turns is just gonna be ridiculousness going on. No, there's there, there's been no sanctioned race on this track at the cup level, okay? So this is an unknown. There was wrecking going on in qualifying yesterday. The pace car spun out. The, <laughs> the pace car spun out. Look it up. It's funny. Listen, this is not to be missed. Oh. If there's one race, and here I go again. I know I've said this probably about... 17 times. If there's one race you don't want to miss, it's oh. this one tomorrow. So, I'll, you know, I'm going to eat my popcorn. I know you're going to be watching um, the, the, the WWE NFL tomorrow. <laughs> um, but look, if, if you can if you can take some time out of your schedule. What time is it on? What it is it on. It's going to be on at 1 16 Central Standard Time on NBC. In not NBCSN, NBC. So we're going to oh, be on network TV tomorrow 
This race is going to be incredible. It's going to be chaos. It's going to be chaos. Let's set this thing up. It's so, so we set 17 turns. What else we got? Well, I was, but I was. Cheers, going, man. Oh my gosh. What I was going to say is. The driver's going to be drinking tomorrow. <laughs> we have we have three drivers locked in, but the rest of them are going to be in panic mode. And that under pressure song is so apropos. It's it's apropos. So uh, yet again, yesterday they're 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 crashing out in qualifying. In in practice, let's set our top ten. Who qualified? So Kurt Busch qualified on the pole. Okay. So he was pretty happy about that. Okay, give me the top five. Who and got? then second is Almendinger, always good on road courses. Yep. Alex Bowman, Showman Bowman, Chase Elliott, and mm -hmm. Larson. You know Larson likes to get loose. Absolutely, he can't care. So then to, uh, to round out that top ten, we have Jimmy Johnson, who's in trouble. He's in where's, trouble. Where, where we have this guy, he's in 14th place. Outside the cut line right now. And, uh, we, and Boyer, who's Boyer, 13th. 13th outside the cut line. We have Jamie McMurray looking for a new ride. Looking for a ride. And then we have uh, a young, young ride. Master, young ride. Uh, uh, young ride, Master Blaney. Yeah. Jesus, what? you're confusing me. Man. I know. And then we got Chris Busher. Yes. Wait a minute. Where's our Busher picture? We do, oh, we got one of these from the track. Yeah, look. Hey. What up, Chris? Hey. I'm going to try to win a race. Yeah, that's that. And so then Notables. Notables. Hamlin, who is, how many Ooh. points? 29 points off the cut 29 line. 29 points off the cut line in 16th. He's starting 27th, but I think he has to go to the back. Yeah, he's already in the back, but now he's going to be even further back because he... They are putting all kinds of band-aids on that car. He was actually helping them put bare bond tape on the back of that car to get back out for qualifying. They are a train wreck. So Kyle Busch is starting 14th. Okay. Chuex yep. is starting 13th, and Harvick 19th, and Keslow 25th. Now, most of those guys don't really care because they, they're done. They could, they could, they're they they moving on. Yeah, so so what I've heard yes. is that a lot of the drivers are talking about just kind of hanging, hanging out. Almost like, a, almost almost like, like a, a, restri a restrictor plate race at the super speedways where you, you just kind of hang out in the back. You don't get too racy. We fill this thing out, and they think they can survive. However, well, what I was going to say, that's good. Let a bunch of cars wreck out. Right. And and then when the field, 10 less cars. Right. Then I'll start racing in stage three. Absolutely. And and you can. Because there's the three stages is 25, 25, 59. <laughs> 25, 25, and 59 laps. We have no idea what this field strategy is going to be. We we looked we looked at some, some stats because we wanted to try to figure out, okay, who, uh, who are our best? Road racers. So we took the only the only two that we could take would be Watkins Glen and then Sonoma over the last ten races. So let's look at that just briefly. So all right, give it to me. All right, so all right, so at Watkins Glen, the number one driver over the last ten races would be Kyle Busch. Okay, but with points at Sonoma, he's averages twelve. Okay, give me another notable. Okay, our pole, our our our, our pole sitter. Talk about him. So we have, uh, we have Kurt Busch. Kurt Busch at Watkins Glen is ranked second. And here he's and uh, at Sonoma he's fifth. Yeah, so so he does pretty well. That 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 that's a pretty good baseline, okay? But let's talk about like people in trouble. So like Clint Boyer. Yep. He's sixth at Watkins Glen and fourth in Sonoma. So that might be helpful to get this, him out of the bottom four. This this could actually be helpful for him. Jimmy Johnson. Jimmy Johnson. He um, at Watkins Glen he has an average of tenth, but. It's Sonoma. Sonoma. He's he's averaging first. Number one, and then so, we have, and, and then so I, I mean Denny Hamlin. Denny Hamlin ranked thirteenth at Watkins Glen and ninth and, at and, Sonoma. And ninth at Sonoma. And just to give you guys an idea, the the closest track I believe to this uh, out of out of Sonoma and Watkins Glen will be Watkins Glen. Would be yes. would, would be a closer um, you know representation of what you may see tomorrow. Oh. But we don't know what we're going to see tomorrow. It's going to be, oh my goodness. Whew. Okay, so we got we, we got that going on. And so anything can happen. Who's going to stay calm? What driver is going to stay calm at this race and be able to win it? Because somebody wants to be the first driver to ever win this thing. These guys have eagles, right? That's right. And it would be a feather in your cap, you know, yeah, okay? I went out here and teamed it. But here's the thing. We were out there qualifying and stuff. That's one at a time, and they were wrecking. Yes, yes. What's going to happen when it's all 40? When they start side by side tomorrow and then enter into turn one, 
and tried and then tried to negotiate that out to get through the turn eight to go back to go onto the track. And then this bus stop that they have, this is they, they're calling it the chicane. So you kind of go in, and then they set these rumble strips up. But then there's a little, they call it like a little turtle, and then there's a little, there's like a, a, a wall. And drivers are hitting this, they're hitting that turtle. Um, Keselowski hit it yesterday in practice, jumped it. To you you stop, get air. To, got air, literally caved in the left side of his car, the, the, the side skirts, and broke the power steering. So they're, they're going to be doing these turns. People are going to try to drive under each other. I, I, I'm going to tell you this. Lap one, there's a wreck. I believe lap I, lap one. There's going to be wrecks. Okay. Hey, I, 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 if I'm taking bets on that, can we call Vegas or anything? Let's, let's you know do. Anybody? It. Hey, where's NASCAR Mike? Maybe we can look him up. Hey, NASCAR Mike, don't do that thing in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So look, make sure you guys tune in. This is going to be awesome. And again, it's going to be one sixteen green flag on NBC, the Bank of America. 400 Roval. Roval. Yep. Okay. So that's enough about that because we just there's just too many unknowns. Oh, it's just going to be craziness. Good and lord. Oh, I'm just in for it. Okay, I'm 100 so, percent in. Absolutely. So let and you know let's talk about some of the some of the, the the driver changes, right? So just there's a lot of youth being infused into this sport. There's being a there's a lot of movement going on, right? I like it. I like so it. You, Shaking so, it up a little bit. So we have Ryan Newman's going to be going back home to Ralph Fenway. He's going to be piloting in the, the the six car, and then we have we have we have a few we have a few more guys rolling in, right? Yeah, we have Ryan. Ryan Priest. Priest yep. taken over the um. What's the uh, Almendinger car? Uh, yeah, the forty-seven car. 47 uh, I mean, so like the, the, we have a lot of young drivers that are that are coming up because they're 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 pushing these guys out. So we know Casey Kane's leaving. He's he's gone. We know Almendinger. We know Almendinger right now does not have a ride. We know that Trevor Bain is out. I mean, they're they're. We don't know where Kurt Busch is going. Kurt Busch supposedly has two contracts on his on his table, but I think it's now only one. And where's we, Truex going? It's where's Truex? Is McMurray going to end up somewhere? Truex has got. He's going to be the first fish to fall because he's the most talented. For sure. Right. And then there's still that rumor: Is he going to take the 19 car over for Suarez? And if he does take that car over, now where Suarez end up? There's a lot to be determined, a lot, lot to happen. Yes. Hey, you guys, you guys have some fun watching this race. Again, make, make sure you guys follow us, interact with us on Twitter, send us some questions if you guys have oh, any yeah, questions. Oh, yeah, let's get back to our questions. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be great if you guys Topics, see what's to cover. All that stuff. Hey, we are here for you. We're on air for you. We're on air for you. You know what? You're welcome. Now, now we're gonna base is loaded. Base is Cardinals. Loaded. Cardinals. Cardinals. What out? Two and one. Let's do this. Sharp is rolling. We're off the air. We will see you guys a little bit down the road. Bye. Peace.